In a whirlwind of controversy and competition, Taiwan's Lin Yuting is on the verge of Olympic gold amidst a storm of gender debates that have overshadowed her Paris experience. The resilient boxer is guaranteed at least a silver medal after overpowering Turkey's Esra Yildiz Karaman in the women's 57kg semifinal bout. Yildiz Karaman, known for her aggressive tactics, threw a flurry of combinations hoping to unsettle the 5'9 Yuting. However, her efforts fell short as Yu Ting secured a dominant 5-0 victory, paving her path to the gold medal match against Poland's Julia Sheremeta. Adding to the drama, Yildiz Karaman repeated a provocative gesture during the match, reminiscent of Bulgaria's Svetlana Kamenova Staniva's actions in the quarterfinals. She formed two X's with her index fingers, seemingly alluding to the female chromosome symbol, reigniting the ongoing scrutiny over Yu Ting's gender. This gesture comes on the heels of a broader controversy engulfing both Yu Ting and Algerian boxer Imani Kelef, who have been at the epicenter of gender identity disputes throughout the Olympics. The two athletes were disqualified from the 2023 World Championships after failing gender eligibility tests, which subsequently led to their ban from the International Boxing Association EBA. EBA president Umar Kremlev had stated that DNA tests revealed both athletes have XY chromosomes. However, the IBA's Secretary General Chris Roberts hinted at the results without divulging details, suggesting the public read between the lines. Despite the IBA's stance, the International Olympic Committee IOC, has stood by the boxers, emphasizing their different eligibility criteria and maintaining the athletes' rights to compete. The IOC, which has also banned the EBA from the Olympics, firmly defended the athletes, with spokesperson Mark Adams asserting Khalif's female identity and credentials. IOC President Thomas Bach condemned the ongoing social media hate and aggression, labeling it unacceptable and refusing to engage in what he described as a culture war. Nevertheless, the relentless scrutiny has cast a shadow over Yu Ting's and Khalif's Olympic journeys. Unfazed by the controversy, Yu Ting chose not to address Yildiz Karaman's gesture post-match, focusing instead on expressing gratitude to her supporters. Entering the gold medal match fills me with gratitude for making it this far, she told reporters, reflecting on her challenging journey from an early exit in Tokyo to the brink of gold in Paris. The highly anticipated women's 57 kg gold medal bout is set for Saturday, August 10 at 3.30 p.m. Eastern Time, where Yu Ting aims to cap her tumultuous Olympic run with a golden finish.